Hello everybody, welcome back to The Binding of Isaac Repentance, today we're doing a special little challenge Can I beat a game with Isaac blindfolded and move the void as my main method of attacking? In order to do this, you're going to use the Darul's mod available at the workshop, go check it out for yourselves, it can raise the fun factor of your game a thousandfold. What are the rules here? We are playing as Isaac on hard mode, we take away the d6, give him the blindfold, meaning he cannot shoot any tears and also give him more of the void. We cannot pick up any item pedestals, be them active items or passive items, but we can pick up trinkets, we can use runes, pills and cards, we can use bombs offensively and we can visit all the rooms, including angel deals and devil deals, to pick up any consumables that might spawn in there, especially health, because we are going to need a lot of that. An exception to the no item pedestal rule is obviously the polaroid or the negative, because we need those to progress further into the game. Our goal is reaching and defeating one of the endgame bosses like Blue Baby or Mega Satan or Beast or Mother or whatever, but let's be, but let's be honest here, I'm going either for the Blue Baby or the Lamp. So let's check out the entries for the Darulis mod at the beginning of the run, take over the D6, give more of the Void, give the Blindfold, nothing more and nothing less. I will start playing, but I will also want to note a few things while we're playing. First, there is an inherent problem with this challenge. Mostly, on later floors, enemies will have a chance of spawning quite far away from more of the Void's reach. Those rooms, I'm either skipping with a bomb, or I'm just plain waiting them out until the doors open, because that's something that happens in this game sometimes. Second, I want to note that I will pre-charge more of the void before entering rooms because the challenge is hard enough already, so yeah, at least give me that. Lastly, I want to say that this is going to be a quite low commentary video. Let's say it's because I have to focus, but honestly it's because I'm terrible at commentating. Let's face the first boss. Dick of Lies should be easy. There we go. Let's go and full clear this floor. It's a good idea. Break all the poops, put out all the fires. We need anything we can get. There is a pill here, and pills are quite important for this challenge. Oh, we got both the secret rooms, fantastic. Well, that one wasn't very helpful. Neither was this one, I guess. Let's go. Also, let's check the seed that was generated in this run. It's going to be XJ3GRQJH. There, there, just in case you want to try it out for yourselves. That is the seed. If you want to try out the specific challenge, you're going to need either a mod like the Darulis mod or the game console. And I'm not sure the game console can do the blindfold thing, so you're better off using a mod. Pills. I don't want to see health down or speed down. Either one of those will destroy this challenge immediately. Health up is fantastic, of course. It was the white and sprinkled one, I think. Speed up is fantastic, of course. It was the red and white one. Okay, it's good to know both those pills are in the mix. Exploding enemies are just the worst for the challenge. As are enemies that leave behind creep. Modeling clay techni technically gives us an item every room, but also it's not an item, it's a trinket. And I said trinkets are okay. I will drop it probably. It feels a bit unfair. 
Also, yes, I took damage and we will miss our devil deal, most probably. But, eh, whatever. Super Secret Room could be in a number of places. And I don't have enough bombs to check at them all. Let's go clear that big room too. Pay attention. Never don't pay attention, kids. <sighs> a reroll room, a dice room. Only thing that would be beneficial is the forget me now room. And a bunch of bombs and a coin. Okay, this will extend the runtime for this run, but also it might help things. Super Secret Room is in... The uh, chance rather for the Super Secret Room is in so many places that I will not bother looking. Ah, well, I guess I will look in one place. No, and here. No, okay, let's go face the boss. Haunt. Should be quite easy, just don't get too close to Haunt on phase 2. Of course the spikes won't allow us to do that either way, so yeah. We should be safe. There, there, easy stuff. We didn't get the devil deal, but we get a do-over. Let's use the Forget Me Now room. This will make us redo the floor. The layout will change, but we're still at the second floor. Uh, this is not the health up. This is one makes you small, which is amazing. We want that. It will help us with dodging and evading stuff. And there is my health back. Okay, game is feeling generous today, I guess. And sure, let's visit the cash room. For two dark hats. Either the game is planning something terrible for us down the line, or I don't know, it's suddenly Christmas again. I don't have a, coin, a key rather to visit the shop. We have gotten three of the better pills we could get, and honestly I don't want to risk it further. If we find the ones we know, we will use them. Now, do I remember what those pills were? No. There he goes, breaking the rule he just set. Let's face pin. Should be easy, even if it's dark pin. It's normal pin, okay. There, there, and we do get the devil deal now, which I am going to skip in favor of angel deals. Because angel deals sometimes spawn, what do you call it? Eternal hearts. And oh boy, do we need those. I will buy the pill. Perks might be helpful down the line. <sighs> mm. 
There's the pack spill. Drop it here. I know what I'm doing here is stupid. But I never said I'm not stupid. Range up does not affect us at all. But in general, the pills have been so kind to us. Let's go down. Third floor. Also, did we check the seed? I think we did, yes. Ooh, Liberty Cup. Each time we enter a room, we might get uh, a mushroom item effect at random, like mini mass or magic mass or blue cup. You know, all the mushroom items we might get an effect. The Emperor can be useful much later on, like on Seol or the Cathedral or, or the Dark Room. I didn't get you. I... I played this room wrong. Planetariums are good because sometimes blue fires or cards might spawn in there, but I don't have enough, have enough keys and I'd rather go... To, well, I now have enough keys. But yes, I'd rather go to the shop than that. I will pick up the Eternal Heart after we're done with the floor. Lots of bombs, let's go face the boss. The Hollow. It should be easy even if it's the Dark it's the Golden Hollow. That's even better. Ooh, another Eternal Heart. Again, I will pick those up after I'm done with the floor. Even though, yes, if I pick two of them up, I will get a full red heart container. Let's just leave them be for now. What was this? Health up. I'm feeling better about the silence. The secret room should be here, the normal secret room. Right there. It's not a great fight. I'm... I'm scared at this point. The game is being... too kind to us. And this game is not known for being kind. Dark Diglets, let them pop up, shoot, and then move in to kill them. Uh, two bombs to get four bombs. Net gain of, well, two bombs. There's a card in here. The sun card. Ah, I kinda want to keep the emperor card, even though the sun card can be really beneficial to us. I have enough bombs and I see most of the places the super secret room could be in. And honestly, they ain't many. Come on, scare the heart. Unless it's off of the mini boss room. This would be weird, to be honest. Yeah. Okay. Looking good. A fantastic floor, I have to say. Let's move on. Fourth floor. Let's go. Mini monstros. Eh, okay, not my favorite, but sure. The flying uh, tear holes, let's call them. Annoying if you don't deal with them right away. 
needles. Three or two. Two, apparently. Extendo neck guys are the worst after the... What do you call him? The exploding enemies. And that is because the Extendo neck guys' range of attack is exactly that of Mo of the Void's reach. So that ain't fun. We are gaining random effects from the Liberty Cup, and honestly, that's good. I will use a bomb here. Nah, it couldn't be there. If I find a golden bomb, I will turn to all rooms to bomb all the mushrooms in them. We know that three very good pills are in the mix this run, so it's kind of a good idea to get them. If we can, we got a magic mass effect in this room. I wish I will get it in more helpful times. Oh, you didn't die. How dare you. What was this pill? That is questionable. Tears down. Yeah, okay. This room can be tricky. Let them move to one side and then move in and kill them. No. And no. I will keep my last bomb for now. Well, that was a dick move on your part, game. You spawned it right at my feet. Terrible move on my part here. There. This is probably a great fight. Yeah. And you give us the steam sail. If I was playing a normal run, I'm guessing you wouldn't do that. Because sometimes, game, you are petty like that. Not that I'm complaining, we have a bunch of good things here going on for us. So, yeah, it doesn't matter. I think the game heard what I said. Sure, let's spend some coins here. No gain from that. Let's go. We are facing the frail. Second phase can be dangerous. The little haunt, not so much. Because... This four-way shot he does in first phase. Second phase, it turns into a four-way shot that breaks into that its tier breaks into four more. That was a dick move game. Missed our angel deal. It's okay. Let's go down. Having said that, it's actually not okay, but what can I do? Depth one, let's go. Well, now it doesn't matter if we don't get the angel deal. Actually, we're kind of incentivized to not get the, the angel deal. But who knows, we might find some bombs until then. And we will be able to bomb those fires. The game lagged there for a moment. Secret room is here. I have no bombs. The sacrifice room can be interesting under the right circumstances.
Ooh, what is this pill? Lack up. I think we have found out what all the pills of this run are. Oh hey, it's not a grid fight. A super grid fight rather, because we already faced grid. Sure, let's take out this card here. The Empress. Actually useful. It can... It will raise our damage and that's something we need for the bosses. There, there. There is said boss. Let's go face it. It's going to be... War. Sure, I'll use the Empress card. And that's mainly because I want to keep the Emperor card for later. Dark War is annoying because it does this six-way shot. Yeah, yeah, and we get an Angel deal after all. Let's trek back a bit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Almost did something stupid there. Okay, this was worth it. I don't want to bomb the donation machine just yet. I knew there were needles in here. Whenever you think there are no needles, there are needles. Live by that rule and you'll be safe. Thank you for this. Judgment card. Yeah, money well spent. Let's go down and hopefully get some pills on the next floor, some of the useful ones. Wishful thinking, I guess. Depths 2. This is where we fight Mum. Ooh, another it makes you want to make you small. That's good, that's good. Tears up, doesn't matter at all. And the soul heart. One makes you small, well, obviously makes our sprite smaller, but also makes our, uh, what do you call it? Our hitbox smaller. Unlike the one makes you larger, that doesn't make your hitbox larger. Ancient Recall. Sure, let's use it now. Devil card, Justice card. Reverse Moon card will take us to the... Ultra Secret Room. We don't need that item from there, though. Might make some coins out of this, actually. Okay, wasted four keys. Oh, and... It was next to the item room. Oh boy, I would love this item. Let the Screecher baby come towards us. There, there. We're not small enough to get through that gap, I guess. Yeah, we're not. Facing the big room because I just had to go back, get my Emperor card. Ooh, 
Ooh, that was an exploding champion. Didn't even realize. I guess that's why I'm bad at this game. I know this is too slow and kind of boring without commentary, but we are at a place where I need to concentrate. I walked right into that, that was totally my fault, not the game's fault. And it's not a super great fight. Another health up. Okay, now I would like some health to fill it up with. Hanged man, yeah, okay, whatever. We need to find the super secret room. I want one more speed up, or two, or three for that matter. Ooh, this room is actually quite easy. Just wait for them to come towards you. Charge them off the void, move backwards, hit them, rinse and repeat. There, there, one more and we'll be done. So, we had to go face mom and honestly I'm not sure where the super secret room is. It's here. This could be interesting. No need to use our own bomb, we can use the barrels. I'd like to pick that up even though it wouldn't affect us in any way. Ooh, more bombs. So, we will face mom. Hopefully normal mom. Or if it has to be a champion mom. Well, at least I hope it's red mom. Just not blue mom. Let's go. It's normal mom. Chip away at his head. We have the... A uh, magic mass effect, so that's nice. Chip away three health, every little bit of damage counts. Doesn't matter if we do it in one minute or ten minutes, all that matters is doing it and getting out alive. Well, I also guess it matters to you if I do it in ten minutes because you will stop watching. But at this point, if you're still watching, you are quite invested. Hopefully invested enough to, you know, subscribe to my channel, push the like button, Leave me a nice comment, share these videos with your friends, if you watch my other videos. Help my channel grow, I would really appreciate it. But only do so if you feel like it, no hard feelings if you don't. Now, I will pick up the negative for two reasons. First reason, I much prefer the negative over the Polaroid, because it gives us a slight damage up. And also, I prefer it because I prefer the Devil fight, the Satan fight in Seoul over the Isaac fight in the Cathedral. At least give me the bombs, mate. That's technically a bomb, yes, but... Eh. Range up, as I said, it does not affect us at all. The only one of our stats that affects more of the void is... Uh, what do you call it? Our damage. Not range, not tears rate, not shot speed. This room is horrible. This room, I hate it. This room can go jump off a cliff. This room I will have to go through again. Found pills, yeah, whatever. Thankfully, it can be avoided. Okay, we are done with that room. Ooh, double bomb. Secret room should be here. I can't see any marked rocks. Yeah. And it's not a super grid fight. Fantastic. 
coins can still help us if we find like an arcade or uh, a fortune telling machine especially would be nice lots of huge rooms in this floor I hate it, I hate it and so do you triple tab fight oh boy Why am I not using the Emperor card? I'd rather keep it for Seol or even better, the Dark Room. I hate these guys, I really do. Those red things are my least favorite enemy in this game. I hate them with a burning passion. Another huge room, thankfully one of the easier ones. The effect we have now is that of skinny old mushroom. I hate those guys. Don't know if I said it before. They get you. Yes, I did. I was almost ready to give up and skip the room. Ouch. This is one of the most terrible floor layouts you could get. Ooh, pin. With lots of needles and those diglet thingies. Oh, it's just one pin though. That's good. Hey, mate. Come here. Okay, you'll die. Ooh, and a golden bomb. Now we're incentivized to look for the super secret room. Found the crawl space instead. Epiphora will not help us in any way, even if we could pick up items. Eat a bomb, please. It's good for you, it's nutritious. And yes, I will return to find the super secret room if we don't find it along the way. I mean, think about how good it will be if we find a couple more pills. That that wasn't true game. You are digging around now. I had more of the void precharged. I released it. And you said, no, it wasn't charged. Fuck you. Okay, we're returning for the super secret room. Blast assist. Okay, it's not that bad. Yeah, yeah, we know we're not getting a, an angel deal or devil deal or whatever. We've made our peace with that game. There, there. Okay, feel free to skip ahead. I am going back for the super secret room. And hopefully any marked rocks that I've missed. There it is. See? That's why you must always visit the freaking super secret room. To get a bone heart and an eternal heart. Fantastic. All I want now is a couple more speed up pills and a couple more one makes you smaller pills. Let's go down.
sorry about the mouse cursor there. I had to fix something on OBS. Okay, let's go find the right way. And let's use a bomb here, just in case. No. We will visit the library. Sometimes cards spawn in there. And we will visit the reroll re room too. That was a tank twister. Eh. Okay. Eh. Okay. Eh. Not okay. I didn't even notice we have. Ah, what do you call it? Cash of the Maze. And I didn't, didn't even notice that creep there. Okay. Cards did not spawn. I could have used that verb pill in a better way, but I didn't even know it was a verb pill. Arcade, now that's interesting. That's we have why we have been collecting coins after uh, Depths 2. We might get like a bomb. Or even an internal heart. There is a chance for that. Luck up. Sure. I can go for Pills game. Let's bomb you up. Stick with a slot machine. Another pill. Is it a health up pill? One makes you small. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not complaining. I will keep the donation, the slot machine intact, just in case we ha find a few more coins. Eggies, if you can time it con correctly, you can get all the spawns in one hit. Chariot card. I mean, sure. Tears up. Tears down. Okay, that wasn't very useful. Moving on. Well, we moved on to suddenly a game. Yeah, maybe, dude, you're going to come here so I can kill you? Because your talent friends are not playing nice. There, there. Strength card. We might actually use a strength card in the It Leaves fight. And keep the Emperor for later. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea, actually. Let's go face It Leaves. As soon as we enter, we must take out the eyes. Let's go. Use the strength card right away. Look at our speed. Look how fast we move. Down to half health already. Well, got a hit already. I'm not expecting to do this in no hits. By the contrary, actually. But again, all that matters is getting out alive. Let's go grab the Emperor card. And let's go heal up. And maybe blow up that slot machine. Oh, now you give me a golden bomb. We found the super secret room. And it's not super grid. We 
We found the actual... Did I say the super secret room? We found the normal secret room. Uh, okay. We still might find slot machines via a... What do you call it? A Wheel of Fortune card or in a secret room. So, yeah. Let's go down. Seol. Now things get really nasty. It's a good idea to bomb skulls if we've had the bombs for it. For dark hearts and cards. Thought you get me, didn't you? Let's go the right way now. Ooh. Easy polycephalus get. Of course, we are under the effects of Magic Mass via the Liberty Cup. Don't waste all your bombs, though. Yeah, I love it when Magic Mass procs. And it seems to do, do so, do so, to do so quite a lot. Uh, okay. Reverse tower card can be helpful. Help help. Up, not alp. Can't speak. I'm actually a bit intrigued right now. Justice card. Well, I could have gone to the next room over, but I didn't think of it. Scared the heart. I don't have the time for this, yes. There you go. Ooh. Super gluttony. Not fun. Less fun than normal gluttony. Even though it's super. Drop health. Drop health. Not the less than three item. For flip's sake, mate. Using the reverse tower card. Hoping for marked rocks. Not the best room I could use it in, but... Well, there you go. Oh, there is one. The game is lagging a bit. Tears down, don't care. <sighs> Broken Ank. Interesting, actually, but I will stick with the Emperor card. Plus, we will need to find some health to go to the next floor. Let's go face Satan. We are at normal effects from Liberty Cup. That's okay. have more than base movement speed and that is very very good of course if we keep walking into things doesn't matter our walking speed now satan try to get him to do the front laser dude you're suffering from acid reflux maybe Maybe cut down on coffee? He's stuck. I don't mind. Oh, you're back. Okay, third phase, his feet. Keep moving. Don't change directions, just keep moving. Chip away at his health.
Avoid the lampreys, of course. They're faster than you, but you can outsmart them. They charge at a straight line, so... You stay away from them by moving... Whatever it's called. On a right angle, I guess. Is what I'm trying to say. That's why you should do what I say and not do what I do. Just one more hit, mate, and you're done. The situation is dire. We don't have enough health. Ah, boy. What was this? The, yeah, yeah, it's our Emperor card. Let's try and trick the challenge room. No, we can't enter the challenge room. How are we going to do this? It's a bad idea trying to clear more rooms. Because that might happen. But we have our moon card to help us. If things get dire, we pop it and leave. Give me health game, please. Well, this counts on things getting dire, I guess. Get out of here first, then check out that card. Judgment card. If we find a bob bomb, maybe. Or maybe you'll be kind enough to pay out with something useful. Just double hearts. Screw me, I guess. Reverse strength card. Enemies will take double damage. For a short duration. Let's keep this, though. I'm just maximizing my chances of actually doing this. Don't tell me I have to get it. Okay. Pride, pride. Please help me. You did not. Honestly, when I thought of this challenge, I never thought I would have to full clear Seol. But here we are. So, at five hits away from death, Emperor card at the ready, let's go down to the dark room and face Lamb. I will try to explore a bit though. I will check out a few rooms and if things get really dangerous like they're about to, we'll pop the Emperor card and hope for the best and hope for Magic Mask to proc actually. Double war. Yeah, this is not good. I should be popping my Emperor card and leaving. Why am I staying? Yeah, screw it. Let's go. No magic mask to help us. Just you and me, lamb.
well, and then the second phase it will be you and me and your body. This again. Second phase coming soon. Take something out. Take the head out. Well, he helped us with the flies. Take the body out. Something needs to go. You spin it. It's okay. By the gods, I did it! Oh my, I did it! There you go, people. If you had any doubts that Mo of the Void is one of the best items in the game, this is proof. I did it. I beat the game with only Mo of the Void and blindfolded and the negative, of course, and Liberty Cup, but still, it wasn't much. And sure, we did get lucky with the pills. We had a couple of one makes you small pills, a couple of health up pills, many eternal hearts, and yeah, speed up, but still, it's hard. It's a hard challenge, and it is done. That was amazing. I'll be honest with you, I've tried this about 30 or 35 times, something like that. I've reached Lamp. Uh, 20 out of those times. I want to say a safe number like 20. And always died in the lamp fight. But this one, and even with better stats, honestly. But this one took the cake and I actually did it. Feel free to do this challenge for yourselves and try it out and see if you can do it better than me with even less stuff. And I will be glad to accept your victory over mine. Thank you everybody so very much for watching. I will see you all in the next one. Until then, stay safe and have fun.